Engineers are now using high-tech visualization and modeling tools to build safer, more reliable structures. These augmented and virtual reality tools are revolutionizing the entire engineering industry. At the Center for Computation and Visualization at Brown University, their fully immersive 3D virtual reality room is allowing engineers to see visual information in a whole new way. This is called the Yurt. The Yurt was built to be a tool for science, a, a tool for looking at data. What you're looking at here is uh, data from the surface of Mars. This is actually the Gale Crater where the Curiosity rover is right now. Um, and what you're looking at is, is not a photograph, it's, it's data. That's what this is about. It's about taking data and exposing it to your intuition in a way that you can just look at it and say, oh, I get it. The yurt not only allows engineers to see structures in new ways, but it has applications for space. You can literally walk on the moon or go inside the human brain, explore spatial poetry, and so much more. So how does this thing work? What is the engineering behind the yurt? So the way this works is that uh, these little uh, reflector balls here, the location of these reflector balls is being recorded by these motion capture cameras that are up on the ceiling. And so the computer knows the position and location of my head and it can adjust the scene uh, according to the position that it sees my head in. Welcome to Rhode Island, the home of Brown University, and also where Ode Engineers Inc. is using immersive and virtual reality modeling tools to rehabilitate a historic power plant from the 1920s into a modern medical educational facility. What's the first step to building a virtual model? Lasers, also known as LiDAR. The use of LiDAR and laser scanning has really changed the way that we can understand existing buildings and infrastructure. So the technology has really advanced very quickly in the last, uh, I'd say, five to ten years to the point where it's accessible to most engineers. Once the laser scanning is finished, a three-dimensional point cloud is made, which is a fancy way of saying a computer model that allows people to view every inch inside and around the building. Engineers take that point cloud and import it into their building information model center, also known as a BIM room. This is a very powerful tool for collaboration. This allows us to troubleshoot problems before they occur in the field. Ode Engineers is also taking advantage of virtual reality, which allows their staff and clients to be fully immersed in the structure. Virtual reality, by removing the bounds of gravity and allowing you to perceive the building in different ways, allows you to now look at the structure and the design in a way that may help you solve some important problems. BIM, VR, laser scanning, all of these digital design tools have revolutionized the structural and civil engineering business. These immersive digital tools will allow us to build structures bigger and bolder than ever before. This is the time to dream big and create a brighter tomorrow.